Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Being the Odds. It is a Wednesday, April 19th, 2023, and we are back with our NBA best bets of the day. If you're new to the channel, my name is Zach, and welcome to Being the Odds. Hit that subscribe button, like this video, hit the notification bell so you never miss a pick. We post NBA videos every single day along with the NHL and MLB. Uh, both of those videos are live right now, so definitely check those out. Uh, we're going after our first 6,000 subscribers, so I'm really excited to have you all here. Let's go win together today. Let's go make some money. So to recap yesterday's results, we had another winning day. We killed it again. Uh, we had the Cavs uh, minus 5.5 as our best bet. Easy winner, never a doubt. We had the Hawks plus 10.5. That was a loss. Close one, but a loss. And then the Suns minus 7.5. I'm just going to tell you all, I'm a master motivator. I tweeted when they were down 48 to 35. The Suns were down 48-35. I tweet, the Suns are straight trash. And then from that point on, they ball the fuck out. I am the master motivator. I should be the coach of the Suns, but I digress. Easy winner there. So uh, Suns at the end area was basically a no sweat winner. We won by 12 or 13 points last night. So 2-1 day overall yesterday. That brings a 255 and 208 record for the season. Um, and listen, we've made guys a lot of money in the NBA. Uh, become a member at zdmbets.com slash picks. As a member, you get our picks early in the day, so you're able to take advantage of early lines and make yourself more money. You get our add-ons texted straight to you, and on top of that, you have a direct line to me. So any game you're considering betting, you can text the number that texts you, and you can get a response by any game you're considering betting. Um, our members are taking very, very strong advantage of that right now, especially yesterday. Um, and we also have some other perks coming out for our members here very shortly. So I'm excited to have you all here and let's go make some money today. So that website, by the way, is linked in the description in the comments below. Uh, we have three picks today in the NBA. We're picking every game. I love these. I, I really like all these games other than my last one, which is gonna, I'm on the limb for. So my best bet today is going to be the Bucks minus six versus the Heat. Giannis or Jonas, Bucks are covering this game. Uh, this could actually help the Bucks because the Heat have been game planning for a Giannis centric game plan. Um, while when Giannis isn't out, they're a little bit more, um, a little more balanced. Obviously not as talented, but a little more balanced. Uh, for me, the Bucks have had the time to adjust and be like, okay, we're going to be out. Giannis is not going to play today. Like just as having that, like, okay, he's not playing today. They were, they had a winning record without him this year. Drew is great. Middleton, if he's healthy, is very solid. They have fantastic size, even without Giannis. Tyler Hero is not playing for the Heat because he has a broken hand. And the Heat are not going to shoot 60% from three um, like they did against the Bucks in the first game. Uh, the Bucks by a comfortable margin here. I like them winning by eight to ten points tonight. Um, it might be a little close on the cover, but I still think they're going to win very comfortably. This could be a double-digit win. Uh, the Bucks are, are a far superior team to the Heat. If they use their size against the Heat, they should absolutely win this game by a large margin. I love the Bucks here my six next we have the timberwolves plus eight and a half versus the nuggets the t wolves will bounce back today they weren't as bad as they showed in game one a perfect storm of bs for the wolves uh really showed up sunday night um coming off of coming off of the play-in then flying into altitude then denver being amped for a game one because they're the one seed and like the crowd was rocking t wolves didn't have the energy uh the t wolves are going to cover this game they're not going to win uh, they have the size to match up with aaron gordon and Jokic. um conley and Ant edwards are great guards um i think denver is deeper so i think they'll eventually win but i see the t wolves covering this game not quite winning but covering this game and i really really like that so t wolves plus eight and a half versus the nugs Next, we have the Grizzlies plus one versus the Lakers. I'm um, going out on a limb here. Um, everyone's going to be like, what are you thinking? And I know the comments are going to get roasted for this. But the sharp money is all over the Grizzlies today. And Reeves and Rui, just listen, it was a perfect storm for LA, like when they played last. Rui and Austin Reeves combined for 54 points. That, that's not going to, listen, that's not going to happen again. Rui Hachimura, I'm a Wizard. I'm, I'm a Wizards fan. Like, I'm not a huge fan because, like, who cares? The Wizards are, like, in D.C. No one really cares about them. But unless they're, like, good and then people, like, moderately care. It's kind of like being lukewarm on something. But I, listen, to be honest with you guys, the, 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 the Lakers had a perfect storm. Rui Hachimura scored 28 points. That's not going to happen. He's not going to do that again. He's not that good of a player. He had a great game, not a good player. Um, Austin Reeves, he's a solid player. He's not driving, he's not driving 26 points. He's just not, it's not going to happen. Um, and listen, you might be like, well, what about LeBron and AD? They're going to score more. Maybe, but I don't think, but I think Rui, I don't think LeBron's going to score 25 more points because Rui's going to score like eight points this game. I guarantee it. That's just how it is. He's a head case. Um, and I, and listen, Bane is really solid. Dylan Brooks can defend LeBron. J Jaron Jackson Jr. can defend, um, Anthony Davis. They've got to get a little tougher on offense. The Grizzlies do, but I like the Grizzlies here to win this game. I think they're going to split and go to LA and hope to God Jaws hand heals up uh, by the time they get to LA because if they lose this game they're dead in the water I think the Grizzlies know that I think there might be a little bit of just like a young team other than LeBron and AD where the foot gets taken off the gas just a little bit I think the Grizzlies here win this game plus one 
Um, so I'm going to take the plus one, but I think they're going to win. You can take the money line there too. Uh, so quick recap, what we have. We have the Bucks minus six versus the Heat. We have the T-Wolves plus eight and a half versus the Nugs. And we have the Grizzlies plus one versus the Lake Show. So uh, let's go lock in those picks, y'all. Let's go win together today. Let's go make some money. I will see you all tomorrow. Make sure y'all check out those other videos.